Atomic Mail Sender is a simple-to-use bulk mailer program that allows you to send an unlimited number of personalized emails to your subscribers or customers. The first thing you need to do is set up your email delivery options. I strongly recommend you contact your SMTP service provider and check the speed and limits allowed for your account, or read it in their documentation. In most cases, you'll want one thread, leave delivery timeout at 120 seconds, and five attempts to send an email is fine. And here's the important thing, H-E-L-O value. You have to set it right. Click this link and copy and paste the line you see on the website. To field, if your mailing list contains actual names of people, use load from list, otherwise leave as it is. You can use the built-in server to send emails, but using an external SMTP is highly recommended. For the purpose of this presentation, we will use Gmail. Currently, it allows sending 500 emails per day. If your mail list is bigger than number of emails allowed by your provider, you can add several servers and set the limit of emails each server can process. Atomic Mail Sender will rotate SMTP servers so you never exceed your limits. I've already entered the correct data for sending mail through Gmail's SMTP. You can leave other settings like DNS, proxy, headers, and miscellaneous as they are. So we have set up everything. And now it's time to test if everything works properly. Click test and here we go. I will check my email and make sure it arrived. This is the message, so it works fine. Let's see what I have in the menu because I will be sending real messages soon. Nothing unusual, a regular text editor. I will show you how to create emails using templates. Click New Message from Templates and choose a template you like and click OK to load it. You can edit the headline, the title, the text, and so on until you are happy with the result. If you are proficient with HTML, you can edit HTML code here or just paste your own template and text. The message is ready. Time to add my mailing list into the project. Typically, you will add recipients from a file or database. Atomic Mail Sender supports several formats, so everything goes smoothly. Adding from clipboard is another option, or you can add contacts directly from Outlook. Most email programs have export functions, so importing a file is the number one option. Now everything is ready, and I push the Send Mail button. The mails are being sent. After that, I will generate a report and save it to keep track of what I sent and to whom. It's a regular Excel file. I can also use the scheduler to send email at the time I want, create a project and set the date and time, and Atomic Mail Sender will do everything else. Now I want to show you a really handy function you can use. You can personalize your emails by adding the recipient's name, website address, and other information you have in your mailing list file. So here I pasted a message. Now I need to load the mailing list and everything is ready. I send the mail out and check my inbox. I have a message with the correct name, URL, and email. And the last issue I want to cover, one of the ways to unsubscribe users from your mailing list. I click Recipients, Unsubscribe, and set up the program to check my email and remove all users that sent emails with Remove or Unsubscribe in the subject field. I can also remove bounced email messages, and I want to do that as well. You should never email people who unsubscribed, and Atomic Mail Sender takes care of that. As you can see, this is a great piece of software that puts you in control of your email campaigns. You can create, send, and track as many emails as you wish.